Hello, Beanie Baby friends. How are you today? Today I'm working on a viewer requested video showing you guys how and where I keep my Beanie Babies. First, we're gonna start in my china cabinet. There are probably 600 Beanie Babies in here. We'll just start at the top and I'll show you the way I kind of have them sorted and organized as we go. So up here we have primates, zodiac, emojis, here all the cats. There's a whole bunch of cats and then we go into the dogs. And then on the top shelf we have like the creepy crawly like amphibians, reptile. We have sea creatures that goes into bears. These are all bears. All kinds of bears. They're just all a big mishmash of bears in there. And then over here, we still have bears. And we have like Valentine's Day and birthday bears. And then like Signature and Clubby are like over in this area. Okay, next we have Halloween and Easter. And then we have a big hodgepodge of farm animals and zoo animals. Like as I go through them and pull them out for pictures and videos, that's when they get organized and reorganized. And then finally over here is the bird section. I don't recommend this way to store them. It's not ideal. Like even their little tag protectors, the ones that have them, they're like popping off. But I know I mentioned it before, like I play with my Beanie Babies every day. I go through them, I pull them out, I'm sorting through them. Um, so this isn't storage. This is like my work area. And right now, I'm looking for Swoop the Dinosaur. Okay, let's be downstairs. Like the mysticals are downstairs already, the dinosaurs are downstairs. So let's head downstairs next. Hi, Donna. You can come with me. Roar. Next up, we have Joyce's bins. I just bought all these. So let's go ahead and see how she has them organized. All of these bins are just full of bears. I'm here for about a week now at my house. Just tons and tons and tons of bears and cases. Now we're gonna go into my cake room, which it has been called because I'm a cake artist. So this is where I keep my supplies. And this is also where I work on the Beanie Babies and the YouTube channel. Like there's my stupid little photo area. And then these all came from Joyce's. Up here we have the Beanie Buddies and they're up here ready to film. And then the drawers. Now she has these organized by year. 94, 95, 96, 97, and 98. And then over here, 2000, etc. And then over here is our teeny beanie babies that are all ready to go through. And then I have a couple more totes here. I don't even know what's in this box yet. I'm pretty excited to check it out though. I have Patriotics. I just finished with those for now. And then like the Mystical and the Dinosaurs are out ready for their photo shoots and video. Looking for Swoop. You're gonna have a photo shoot today. You can see behind them food coloring and cookie cutters. Right, so down here then we have Christmas Beanie Babies. And then those are St. Patrick's Day Beanie Babies. And then we have Mother's Day Beanie Babies. And then we have Father's Day Beanie Babies. That's that. Thank you so much for that question. I'm happy to show you guys. Um, I don't necessarily recommend that this is the best way. It's just the way that I'm working with now. And it was different last month and it's going to be different next month. So thank you for that viewer question. I always love viewer questions. If you have any questions for me, go ahead and email me at beaniebabybabies at gmail.com. That's it for me today. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.